Welcome back everybody to the 13th stream of Oblivion Mage Only Run. And let me tell you, it has been quite the journey to try and get this stream off the ground. Uh, the previous time I was doing it, I don't know what was going on, it was just crazy bad. Then I tried to switch it to Fridays, and that was bad too. So now I'm back to Thursdays, and hopefully it's a lot better this time around. And maybe we can actually complete stream number 13, instead of having it be an unlucky number, right? So, first and foremost, we need to talk to the hey. Baron? Baroness? Baroness. Countess. Sorry. And uh, figure out Hello. which Oblivion it's Gate exactly she wants us to get rid of. I'm Countess Valga of Coral. Valga. I wish I had time to chat, but I'm afraid I'm in the middle of an investigation. That I am totally not interested in, by the way. So just give me aid for Bruma. While I it. understand Bruma's need, Coral's own defense must come first. I cannot spare any soldiers. As long as Coral remains under threat from the Oblivion Gate outside our walls. Very well, just point me in the direction I'm on it. Goodbye. So. Hello. Let's see here. It is the one directly south of the gate. That's exactly the one I was expecting anyway. So beautiful town this is. It's got a centralized area and everything. If I'm not mistaken, the Coral uh, Bliving Gate is probably the most confusing one of the bunch. Because I actually had to do it about a week ago, and I had trouble figuring out where the heck I was supposed to go. So, there it is, straight ahead. No big deal. We've done this so many times before, so why not? Let's get this Oblivion Gate out of the way. For this stream, anyway. Oh, there's a spider Deidre. And a clan fear. Moving back. Where's the clan fear? Okay, clan fear's dead. And spider Deidre's dead. Okay. Let's hope no more enemies have appeared since we... Okay, there we go. Good, good. Okay, this is confusing. There are like five towers to this place. I'm trying to figure out which tower is going to be the one that's going to let me in. Oh, gosh. Okay, that looks like a hunger over there. So, just avoiding these altogether, I think we need to go this way. Now, there's that sinking tower right there, which is kind of like similar to the tower right over there, but it's like a huge Easter egg, and I don't really know how to get inside of it, but there's some nice loot in there in, in case you do. So, whatever. Hunger is down. Okay, there's a lot of ways to go and a lot of ways to get lost. Especially in this one. Okay, for this one we want to use the ice staff. Anything that's fire based would probably be best used on the ice staff. Okay, and we're done with that. So far, so good. Mm, I don't know where to go. I don't know where my next avenue is. Okay, I know I want to get over there. Okay, so clearly I'm going in the wrong direction. I need to take the long way around, further out. Oh, of course. Alright, might as well use a potion. What'd I just do? I did not mean to do that. Alright, cool, I can pick up a lot of stuff now. Ooh. 
Who's after me? Oh, I just stunned her. I didn't actually kill her. Go figure. Alright then. So there's nothing over there. So we're going to have to go further out where their Daedroth is over there. Avoid these annoying... Oh, two Daedroths. Look at that. <laughs> oh, that hurt. Okay, clearly I think this is the way to go. This is going to lead me to a tower, maybe? Oh, what was that? Okay, this... This looks promising. This looks very promising. Leads me straight to one of them towers. Mm -mm -mm. Here we go. Oh, no. No! <laughs> it crashed! Oh, this... Oh, this stream is going off to a great start. Awesome start, everybody. Awesome start. So let's see where exactly the latest save file was. This is the same problem that happened in the previous stream. Like, seriously, it crashed like shortly after I went to the Oblivion Gate. It's like this game doesn't want me to go. Oh, oh my gosh. I have to go all the way back here. All the way back here. Okay. We're going to take the fast track, everybody. We're totally taking the fast track. We're going to go directly into the portal kill anything that gets in our way and just forget the secret subterfuge part. We know where we need to go. We need to go all the way around to that side of the oblivion world gate thing and uh, just get into that small tower on the side. There's like five towers surrounding the one main tower and that's where we need to get in. So now that I know the way ahead, it's going to be a lot faster and a lot easier. I wonder if there's another spider Daedra that appears here. No, it is a seducer. Okay. And there's only one enemy instead of two. Look at that. So it loaded the different types of enemies as soon as I left Coral. Okay, we're going to totally avoid these creatures. I'm going to take the fast track. Oh, yeah. Clan fears are dangerous. They need to be taken care of. <laughs> oh, that's so much fun knocking them off their butts. Okay, I need to go to the right, and then I go to the left. Another seducer. Who's firing on me? Another enemy? No. Ooh, I'm almost dead. Okay, this is going a lot faster this time. Probably because I'm not caring what's going to happen here. Okay. Okay, you go all take care of them now. I'm just going to continue on ahead. Take care of the spider Daedra for me. Making it through, everybody, quicker than normal. There's no two Daedras and Daedroths here either. Okay, that's what I want, all the way over there. Okay, <laughs> it didn't take long to recover my progress, but we're here now, and hopefully, don't crash. There we go. 
So something tells me I'm gonna have to go to each of these five towers. Landslide. Uh, I'm not really sure what to do. Is there an enemy up here? Landslide gate. I don't know. Uh, okay, we're gonna go to the center. no enemies in the center. There are two chests, though. Two heart-based chests. I'll take them. Why not? So I'll go to the next one over. Let's see. How is this laid out? Okay, I opened that gate. But where's the actual entrance? Huh. Where's the entrance to this to this tower in the center? Oh, I got a 50-50 shot here, everybody. And I did it! Awesome. I picked the right one. Whoa! You were following me this whole time? Oh, wow. You just wanted to die. Okay, so there was landslide, there was eruption. So that's two weird tower names. So I'm assuming each of these towers has some sort of catastrophic name to it. Just a hunch. <clears throat> so I think I'll go to each of these towers and open them up. Was I? Wait a minute, was I already here? Tornado. Here we go. Tornado. Okay, it looks like I'm opening up all these gates. Looks like there's one more to do. Oh, hello there, buddy. Okay, got a 50-50 shot. And I failed. There he goes. Oh, that sucks. Sorry, buddy. Another tornado gate. Where's this take me? It doesn't take me anywhere. Okay, I want to get down there. Because I think... I think the exit out what I need... Ooh! Man, that dude got impaled! <laughs> oh, gosh. I gotta be careful here. I gotta be careful where I stand. Especially on these platforms. Because I could get impaled just getting on here. In fact, I'm going to hop off right now. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, is there a... Am I... Am I missing something? I thought there'd be, like, a door down here. What happened to the dude? Oh. He's like, okay, he fell off the spike. Okay. I want to go this way. This brings me to the center area. There's a day draw. There's a minefield here. There's some 
reducers. There's all over the place enemies. And I am just obliterating these things. Alright, where is this dungeon entrance? Looks like I'm going to have to make the whole gamut around this tower until I figure out where everything is. This is where I was. Here's the towers. I am... Is this it? Is this it? Is this the one I need? Oh, hello. I'm like, who spotted me? Hey, how you doing, Crystal Father? I am so sorry for the past two weeks. Oh my goodness. It's like stream number 13 has seriously been the unlucky stream trying to get this going. You haven't missed too much. This this particular Oblivion Gate is so confusing. Like I had to get around to one of these five towers separating this main tower. I had to go to each of these four towers right here to open up these massive gates that you see here and here all around the tower just so I can get into this tower which I think leads me into a lower portion of the tower where I can actually move higher up. This is so complicated. This is the Coral Oblivion Gate. Oh my gosh. It's like the most complicated gate. Oh, hello. Complicated gate I've been to yet. Why did you not die? Ooh, that looks painful. So how you been these past two weeks? I haven't seen you in a while. A lot of stuff going on, huh? <laughs> yeah, some of the some of the unique ones are really puzzling. Wow, look, dude, perpetually on fire, burning corpse. Black magic. <laughs> All sorts of black magic up in this business. Alright, there are no switches in this tower, which means I was correct. This is the, the tower I want to get into. i go back down to this. Okay, now we're going to finally enter the tower proper. So. You were at a party? That's cool, man. Party is far more important. Gotta li let live sometimes. Which way do I go? Rending halls. That sounds as good as any. Oh my. Okay, that enemy's dead. Looks like nothing but. But fire enemies, which is good. Did something hurt? Whoa! Oh, it's one of those traps. It's one of those traps that fall down from the ceiling. Ow. Got to be careful here. I hear it, and I see the effects of it. So, what was the party for? Was it just a just a party, just because, or was there a special event? Oh my gosh! Look at that. There's several of them. Oh, this could be bad. Hold up. Oh, <laughs> oh wow. Oh my gosh. They mean business this time. They're serious now. They're trying to kill me. Oh, just because... Was it fun? Was it worth going? That's the main thing. 
Run the gauntlet. Yes, I snuck through it very gingerly. <laughs> Run! Run, you stupid Breton, run! Oh, look at this! Look at this ragdoll effect! Oh, yeah! That was funny! Oh, that was great. That made my night. Oh, who's, si who's seen me? That's, uh, hunger. At this point, I'm no longer afraid of hungers anymore. They're so easy. I remember back at the battle for uh, Castle Kavach, they were so scary hard. I was like, no, I don't want to meet any of them. They're too terribly hard. Mariachi band and everything. Oh, those are the best type. Get your little dance groove on. I gotta look up just in case there's like one of them crazy switchblades gonna slice my head in half. Whoa! There goes my uh, <laughs> my frame rate again. The usual, no big deal. Oh, did not even see you there. That scared the crap out of me. Not literally, but you know, figuratively speaking. Otherwise, I'd have to stop the stream right now. <laughs> well, it's good to be back in the Oblivion world again. That much I can say. Uh, this is actually the first gate I've been through. Uh, as I think I mentioned in the previous uh, stream two weeks ago, uh, I'm actually just going to do one Oblivion Gate a stream, This, and I just want to get this one out of the way straight from the get-go. So this is my one and only Oblivion Gate. There's one more. It's in Chain Hall, and uh, that'll be for the next stream. So this stream, it's just this one. So, whew. <laughs> oh, I was like, is that a spider, Daedric? Is that kind of... Oh, gosh, it's a... Clan fear. These things are still dangerous. Oh my gosh. Those clan fears are still dangerous and painful. But we're near the end. We are so near the end. So you won't be getting too much gate fatigue on this one. I guarantee it. Hey, how you doing, Jolly? The Jolly? 93, how you doing? <laughs> how do you pronounce that? So welcome to the stream. How you doing tonight? This is our one and only Oblivion Gate we're going to be grinding through. Normally I don't really grind through Oblivion Gates because they get kind of boring, so I'm just doing the story-based ones only. So, yes, I will be getting that Sigil Stone. I just was kind of hoping for some chests, but they aren't going to give me any chests. Because they usually are underneath these awnings. Oh, hello. Oh, you got to be like that. Fine, fine. I can uh, give as good as I get. Boom, look at that. Boom, look at that. And just for good measure, let's summon Frosty in here. Just because I can. Oh, yeah, look at that. Mm. It's George in English. Oh, okay. 
So should I just call you George or Jolie? <laughs> yes, this is modded Oblivion. Uh, it's still primarily mage only run. I have not really modded the magic too much. So who is left? Oh, that's who's left. There we go. And I also have Oblivion Overhaul, uh, Obscuro's Oblivion Overhaul still active. Man, this guy just will not die. There we go. It's from the Balkan region. Oh, well that's cool. Is that where you are right now? Is that how you're viewing my stream from there? That's pretty awesome. Well, welcome. It's always awesome to get international viewers. What is this? Curess of Vitality. It's so awesome that it's heavy as 40, 40 pounds. I can't... I can't risk it. Uh, it's too heavy for me. Oh, here we go. It's gonna be a frame rate killer. Yes, every time I do a sigil stone, the frame rate goes to crap. It's just a part of the game. Whatever. It'll fix itself in time once I get out of the gate. We are done with that gate. Where are we anyway? Oh my gosh, I'm lost. Where? Where? Oh, here we go. <laughs> I was like. I'm doomed! The game has trapped me. Oh, you know, I don't care if your English is weak or strong. As long as you enjoy the game as much as I do and you, you, and you just enjoy watching and playing and maybe even have some good banter, it's all good with me. I'm easy going. Besides, if I ever get confused, I'll just uh, ask for clarification. So, no big deal. So let's go and get some aid for Bruma. Like, all of, like, one or two guys. So, like, sure, we'll send our best Bye, troops please. for you. And then just send you, like, two dudes. Great, thanks. <laughs> that was so much help. We are fighting against the denizens of the underworld. And you're going to send me two dudes. Wait a minute, where's Countess? What time is it? Oh, of course. It's like past her bedtime at 6.23 p.m. <clears throat> She's gotta have her beauty sleep, so we gotta wait till the next morning. She's too busy getting ready for bed to even talk to us. Hey, we got that oblivion get rid of you. Blech. Hello, I'm Leith Wafrick. The Chief Herald and Countess Velga's attendant. Can you Welcome send aid to Bruma? To no, you can't. Then you were worthless to me. Fare Thank you. Well. Is that her? No. Okay, we're gonna wait one more hour. She has me waiting all over the place. We're more popular. That is true. Hello. Uh, if you've, it's a I've... pleasure to meet you. <clears throat> I'm Countess Velga. I don't care. Cor Thank you. I've actually play, been playing uh, The Witcher 3, The Wild Hunt, and let me tell you, those towns are populated. Holy crap. I have never felt like there was a town that was more alive than in that game. Like, the entire huge city of Novigrad really feels like a city. There's just people all over the place. During the day, during the night, it's just all over the place. It's, it's an awesome, awesome experience. Your anyway. reputation precedes you, Hera of Kavach. You have done my city a great service by closing the Oblivion Gate. Thanks, and I'll send your two dudes to aid I will Bruma. now gladly send soldiers to aid in the defense of Bruma. Consider it done. I don't care about your investigation. Goodbye. Go solve it on your Good own. To see you. Don't care about some stupid painting. Anyway. Hey. <laughs> that guy was picking up on me. Hey. <laughs> All right. So, we are done with that. There is one more Oblivion Gate to do for the Aid for Bruma quest, and that is in Chaden Hall. Uh, I only played the Dark Brotherhood 
up until I think like the Shadow Mare where you get the horse and then I just kind of lost interest in it. It was kind of like, it was getting a little dark for me. Not that it was already dark already. <laughs> but I have beaten the Fighter's Guild quest and the Thief's Guild quest in the past. And of course the main quest. But I have never ever touched the Mage's Guild quest. And this is why I'm doing this stream. Is to do the... It's disproportionate. <laughs> it was! It looked kind of funny, didn't it? No, but this is the first time I've ever done the Mage's Guild quest line. Uh, I stopped the last time when I tried to get recommendations from everybody uh, from all the towns and I'm just like, screw that. I don't want to go through each and every town and get recommendations. I should just be entered into the guild. So I, I've been avoiding being a mage for the longest time, but you know, per my challenge, I'm going to be like, I'm just going to be a mage and I'm going to use the Atronach birth sign, which some people have said I'm crazy for doing, but whatever. Okay. We have the Necromancer's Amulet. The Bloodworm Helm, two Mages Guild quests, and then Miss Garkend, which is a main quest. Uh, so, now if I know if I do Miss Garkend, that'll shove me right into the the final Oblivion Gate, and I don't want to do that just yet um, until I get ri get rid of the Oblivion Gate at Chaden Hall. So, I think I'm gonna do either the Necromancer's Amulet or the Bloodworm Helm. Which do you think I should do?